So our alpha is equal to 0 0.05. Okay. So we have here 0, 0 0.05. Okay, so to so let's determine the tabular. So the degrees of freedom is four, and then we have zero point zero five. So you have nine point four eight eight. So the com the tabular chi square is equal to nine point four eight eight. Okay, so let's try to compute the tabular at the computed chi square. So for the computed chi square, what we are going to have, okay, is this is equal to you are just going to have uh, the uh, not yet we are going to identify first the 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 expected for the expected okay for the expected you have uh, you have 139 times 117 divided by 5 to 8 and then you also have uh, 248 times 117 over uh, 5 to 8 and then you also have 141 times 117 over 528 and then you also have uh, 139 times 276 over uh, 528. Then you have uh, 248 times 276 over 528. And then we have 141 times 1, uh, 276 over 528. And then we also have the uh, 139. Okay, that's 139 times uh, 135 over 528. And then another, you have 248. Okay, times 135 over 528. And then the last one, you have uh, 141 times 135 over, you have 528. Now, using the calculator, okay, we could have this one is equal to 30.80. Uh, this would be equal to uh, this would be equal to 54.95 this is equal to 31.24 then we have 72.66 then you have 129.64 then this would be equal to uh, 73.7 and this one would be equal to 35.54 okay 54 this is equal to 63.41 and this is equal to 36.05 okay so we already have our computed uh, Okay, so we can now uh, use the formula. So here we have 56 minus 30.8 quantity squared over 30.8 plus 
you have the quantity uh, 47 minus 54.95 quantity squared over 54.95 plus you have 14 minus 31.24 quantity squared over 31.24 plus you have 71 minus 72.66 quantity squared over 72.66 plus you have 163 minus 129.64 quantity squared over 129.64 plus 42 minus 73.7 okay quantity squared over 73.7 Plus, you have, the last one, you have 12 uh, minus 35.54 quantity squared over 35.54 plus you have 38 minus 63.41 quantity squared over 63.41 plus you have 85 minus 36.05 quantity squared over uh, 36.05 okay so we can use the calculator okay in getting the values of this one okay and that would be equal to 145.79 okay so our computed okay chi square value is equal to 145.79 now take note that our computed okay computed chi square is equal to 145.79 and our tabular Okay, chi square is equal to 9.488. So, this case, our okay, our computed chi square is greater than our tabular chi square, which implies that we are going to reject. The null hypothesis. Therefore, we could now say that, okay, at uh, at five percent level of significance, okay, there, okay, is sufficient. Okay, evidence to reject the claim. Now, if we go back to our problem, the claim is, okay, you have uh, blood pressure. Is independent. of the degree of smoking oops smoking so in this case okay we could now say that the the blood pressure is dependent to the degree of the smoking so as you uh, as these uh, the result implies that if uh, the the blood pressure will increase okay 
if the degrees of smoking also increase because they are dependent with each other. Okay, so that's the implication of this problem. Okay, so that's all for the chi-square.